Grams are in 3.5 kilograms. Circle the letter of the correct answer. He did C, 3,500 grams. Rodney chose D as a correct answer. How did he get that answer? Rodney does math like my mom. Oh, Rodney got the wrong answer and he roasted his mom. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the crazy and just all around funniest kid test answers. You will not believe what I say for the end of today's video. It is insane. Let's do this. Write five words you can spell. Five words you can spell. This kid's a genius. They literally gave him the answer. That teacher is going to reword the test. To change centimeters to meters, you what? Take out Senny. How do kids think of this? I swear some of them are actual geniuses. Okay, so this person needs to get the princess to the village or to the castle. Obviously, it's the castle. My bad, you guys. And what do they do? They just go around the outside. Why make it complicated? How are so many kids so smart? I would never think of this. 358 dot. Write about what will be different in a thousand years. Dead. Homie said, I'm going to be dead. And he just drew himself a coffin like his headstone. That... It's kind of dark, dark, but true. true. A, who is your hero? Dad. Why do you consider this person your hero? He is brave. Is there anything your hero is frightened of? Mom. Oh, well, at least the kid doesn't lie. Use words or numbers. Sentences explain how you found your answers. I think, dude, I swear, this lady, whoever this teacher is, I think it's a girl by the fingernails. She goes home and she like just shows her husband this and she's so proud. Like and subscribe right now for amazing luck for the next week. There are 26 kids at the beach. Then 37 more kids come. How many kids are at the beach? Homie oh, said too many for COVID-19. That right there is a correct answer. Defend your answer. Oh my goodness. Guy literally put barbed wire fence around the word answer and like put out some like chopper gunner type thing to make sure. Sarge, I don't know how much longer we can hold them. He literally defended the word answer. Dude, put this kid in Harvard. True or false? Okay, you guys, so 11, he wrote fru? Fru, 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 fru. Dude, he's literally a genius. He tried to start it off like it would be a true false-ish, like so he doesn't really know. How did the teacher not give him this? He wasn't wrong, nor was he right. Activity three, brainstorm verbs. What do you like to do with your friends and family? Comment the sentences below with the action verbs like jump, dive, float, or swirl. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it. This kid's a genius and he threw in some creativity. What ended in 1896? 1895 ended, obviously. They better gave him a A plus for that. Name the quadrilateral. On the first one, he said Bob. And then he named the second one Sam. He named the third one Harry. He named the fourth one, Tedison? And he named the fifth one, Kate. That right there is correct in a sense, but that's supposed to be a square, then uh, whatever that thing is, then a rectangle, then like a diamond or whatever that thing is, and then uh, whatever that thing is. I would probably have failed that question too. Extra credit, what is the strongest force on earth? Love. Aw, this kid's mom's teaching him right. The man can run. Wait, what do he write? The man Pet the dog. You should not hit dogs. It said fit or hit. You should not hit dogs. And the kid said it right. How is this even in the school? This kid right here deserves an absolute scholarship to Harvard. Who's going to sponsor him? Write an example of a risk. This. That answer right there was a risk. I got to be honest. And it worked. You got to take risks in life. You are to assume the role of a Chinese immigrant in 1870 and write a letter home describing your experiences. Your letter should be included in the following. Your contributions and experience in the West. Dude literally wrote everything out in like Chinese characters. I don't think the teacher can pass him or fail him for this. And they definitely just had to give him A because that dude just went through and learned Mandarin or something. Briefly explain what hard water is. Ice. Ice is definitely hard water. <laughs> Ice is definitely hard water. I don't think that's the kind of hard water they meant, but well done. Name Frankie. I earn money at home by I don't. I am a freeloader. I think for them to know what a freeloader is, their parents have called him a freeloader for not doing the dishes before. Find X. He literally just circled it and said, here it is. You're a genius. The difference between 
180 and 158 is 22. Try this. Explain how you found your answer in problem four. Math. <laughs> Dude, kids never fail to impress me. Cause, Tony practices a piano 20 minutes every day. Effect, he is a big nerd. Hey, be nice. But that right there is kind of true. 11. Bobby has four dimes. Amy has 30 pennies. Which child has more money? Bobby. How do you know? Show your thinking. Hmm. Bobby. Describe yourself in three words. I am a rebel. All right, let's stop right there. Buddy, that is four words, but... You are a rebel for using four words, not three. The importance of timing and decision making. I don't know. I'll tell you tomorrow. <laughs> Genius. Math test one. Bob has 36 candy bars. He eats 29. What does Bob have now? Diabetes. <laughs> Bob has diabetes. Gosh, dang it, man. 29 candy bars in one sitting. Yeah, I think you will have diabetes. What do you think is the best solution to overpopulation? Support your argument with your aunt. <laughs> I read the answer. I just laughed instantly. The Hunger Games. That is savage. There are four ghosts. Then one ghost flew away. How many ghosts are left? Four minus one equals zero. Because ghosts are not real. Dude, this kid. I love it. I love it so much. These just keep getting better. You will not believe what I say for the end of today's video. Which is the best estimate for the length of a football? One football is the best length. Is there enough information in the table to estimate the length of a day on Jupiter? Bacon? Give the reason for your answer. Bacon is always the answer. Hey, not for me. I may get hate for this, but I just do not like bacon. I don't understand how so many people eat bacon or love bacon so much. It's not even good getting roasted in the comments right now aren't i do not write your essay on this paper <laughs> guys a savage he said your essay savage alice places a prepared slide on her microscope but she looks into it she can't see anything so just one reason why not she is blind that is a good reason why she can't see it, and that is a valid reason as well. I wonder what the teacher marked on this one. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Bards. That is love. I think my mom should do less of this. Cute drawing, and then drink wine. Sounds like somebody mom's an alcoholic. Right? Or. So they just wrote or. Now you're supposed to say which one's greater or less than, and they just wrote or, 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 or. You can't really mark them wrong. This boy is, it's either sad, glad, or he added C as in ugly. Enough is enough, Judy, is what the teacher wrote. Hey, don't make fun of the poor guy. You're supposed to expand this equation. So literally, they just kept expanding it. And it said, very something, Peter. Oh, very clever, Peter. I have no clue what they said, but <laughs> you, they're kind of genius. There are 300 students in year 10. Mary and Mark want to find out year 10's favorite color. Mary asks 30 people. Mark asks 150 people. Mark says, my conclusions are more likely reliable than Mary's. Why does Mark think he is right? Because Mark is a man. <laughs> because Mark is a man. Hey, that right there is called sexist. Tracy says, blah, 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 math stuff. Tracy is wrong. She uses an example to show how Tracy is wrong. She's a woman. What the heck is up with all these? Oh my gosh, you guys. Quit it. Use commands to tell your sister to do the following things. Irala conchina serku. Careful. I don't know, but they answered, I do not have a sister. Hey, that is valid. And if you don't have a sister, you can't tell her to use those things. So how did he get minus seven points there? Okay, some crazy equation. And he just did a line tan x, 2x, whatever it is. Jesus is always the answer. <laughs> but then the teacher said, not on this question. Jesus is always the answer. Well, you guys, if you enjoyed this, I had a lot of fun looking at these funny tests like answers. If you guys want more videos like this, smash the like button. Also, press on other videos on the screen right now to watch more videos just like this one. And I'll see you guys over at one of those videos. Catch you later.